You may have seen reported in the newspapers and in social media this morning that long-term Deating player Charlie Manali was in breach of clause 7.2 in the player's contract through appearing for Bamuda E-Team on Sunday. Meetings have since taken place between management staff, the board and the player, and before this matter gets taken out of hand, Charlie has been given the opportunity to make a statement for the team, the media and the fans. Thank you. Why did you do it? You've got no friends! Ladies, gentlemen, friends, and most importantly, the D team, my family. I'm here today to publicly apologise for a heinous crime I've committed against not only the D team, but against myself. On Sunday, the 1st of February, I breached, contract, I breached the contract I signed on the 17th of October 2014 concerning 0.7.2 under the title Term, Breach and Termination. This states that I will not represent any other football team unless terms are agreed upon by Matthew Coward and the captain of the other Van Milder team. Last night I played for the Van Milder E team without the permission of Mr Coward and without terms for the loan being discussed. This rash decision has not only cost me my pride but it has meant the D team have fallen even further behind the heat in the league table. As much as I'd like to say I only played a small part in this victory for the E team, it pains me to reveal that I, I scored a goal that could condemn the D team to a league finish below that of the E's. All I can do is beg for forgiveness from my manager, my captain and of course my teammates. The fans that have stuck by me for my now two year stint with the D team will know the love I have for this club. As a previous captain of the D's, I should know that playing for the E team is an unforgivable crime. However, I'd like to draw everyone's attention back to the start of my career at the MAFC. I was a C team player to begin with, and as a C team player, I developed a friendship with the then E team captain, Phil Welsh. Welsh came to me as his go to man in relation to a ring up or a short term loan signing, and this is where my history of the E team started. However, I moved to the D team, and due to a lack of opportunity, banter and of course curries, I somewhat ended my affiliation with the E team. I will leave you with this however. On his departure from VMAFC, Phil Welsh asked me to play for the E's one more time. To play in his honour and to give no quarter. Last night was my duty to carry out Phil's legacy and to honour a promise I made to a friend. I'm truly sorry. Amen. Thank you. Any questions? Okay, thank you.